hope you guys are enjoying my my channel. I travel a lot and uh, teach a lot all over the world. And you know, every craftsman, every artist has their story. Mine started a long time ago. I've been doing this almost 40 years. It started when I became a dancer. My little sister was asking me to take her. I go, what kind of dancing are you doing? She goes, I'm doing Aztec dancing. I go, Aztec dancing? I'm thinking, what? I'm thinking like, does that even exist? Is that a thing? And so, um, you know, I took her. She goes, once you come in, it's gonna be in about a couple hours. And as soon as I stepped in, I hear the shell, the, the conch shell, and also the drum. What I think at that, what I know now is called piercing the heart. It's kind of to waken up, like the memory, internal memories that you have, cellular memory. And I could not move. And um, I knew this is what I had to do at that moment. And from that point on, my life changed. You know, I knew about my indigenous history and my indigenous background, but I never really practiced it. But now I, have a, I had a new passion, and it's about finding myself. And uh, a little bit after that, I ran into my teacher, um, and how that happened was I was really shy, and I was, you know, I was a fairly good looking guy, and this elder, he asked me, hey, uh, so you have a girlfriend? I go, no, he goes, uh, should I? He goes, yeah, you're a good looking guy, you should have a, he goes, well, I, I just don't know how to talk to him, he goes, what? He goes, he goes what you need is a flute. He told me the story of the, this type of flute over here, the, the native flute, the, native, uh, the plain style flute, and how this young man was able to overcome his shyness and be able to win the heart of this beautiful young woman. And I was thinking, I was quite taken by the story, so, you know, I pursued someone. Um, you know, I'll do whatever it takes, but can you, can you show me how to make one, or can I help you? And he, he just pretty much shot, shot me down. And it, was, it wasn't much later than I met the gentleman that became my teacher, and that was Javier Quijas. And uh, I asked him what I wanted, and he goes, oh, that one of those? Oh yeah, just come to the studio. We can make one real quick. He made me a, a cane one, you know, a bamboo one. He did it pretty fast, you know, we worked together. And, and then, you know, I learned to play that, and then he gave me a clay flute to, to practice on as well. And, uh, and I kept coming back, and I kept learning. Eventually, we started working together. And, um, you know, I, st I started producing shows with him at Knott's Ferry Farm. And we started putting uh, the vision together, what he ha which he had was to bring the, the traditional instruments and the dance back together. Because at that time, before, prior to that, it was just it was just dancing. It was just a drum and dancing, and um, but it was more than that. Today, you see a lot of groups. They play the clay flutes. They have you know they some of them practice and actually you know work out work out the music to the to the dancing. Very glad to be part of that, and uh, you know I've been teaching too. You know I teach, you know I've taught all over the world, and I've been fortunate. You know when I first started this journey, I didn't think that I'd be doing what I do now, but you know it's given me a beautiful life and beautiful children and beautiful friendships. Not to be taken lightly, you know, if if this is something you want to do. You know, you have to take it very seriously and not do it for, for commercial reasons, but, you know, because your heart's, that's where your heart is. You know, these instruments are instruments of prayer. 
these are instruments that people used for you know for literally thousands of years to connect to the spirit world to connect to nature you know to connect to to that higher power they're instruments of healing you know truly blessed you know for you know for my path and my teachers because I've had a few and now I, I teach and you know all those teachers are behind me as well